Hey, it's me, John Conley with Success Real Estate. This week, I wanted to talk to you guys about appraisals. What's the purpose of an appraisal? What's the cost of it? And how does it all work? Well, when you go to purchase a home, a bank is going to require you to hire an independent appraiser, and the bank will set that up for you to put a value on the home. How do they go about putting the value on the home? They're going to go out and find three like homes to the one you're going to be purchasing. When I say like, so it's a colonial to a colonial. You can't do a colonial to a ranch style home. So once they find three homes that have recently sold in the last six months, they're going to help use them to determine the value of your home. They can also use homes that are under contract and scheduled to close. Now the cost of this is going to be somewhere between three to five hundred dollars um, in order to be able to have the appraisal done. Now you're purchasing the home for three hundred and fifty thousand dollars and the appraisal comes in at three hundred and sixty thousand dollars. Well someone's going to pat you on the back and say that's a great value. But what happens if the opposite occurs? What happens if you purchasing the home for $350,000 but yet the bank appraiser comes in at $340,000? Now what's normal is you go back to the seller and say, hey, this problem is going to happen again with the next appraisals. There are no comps to support it. You need to come down on your sale price. But as we know, we're in a growing real estate market with the values and the seller may say, no, I'm unwilling to do that. What are you left to do, especially if you love the home? Well, at that point in time, you've got to be able to come up with what the difference is. So if the appraised value is at $340,000 on top of your down payment, you're going to need to come up with that additional $10,000. I hope this was of some help to you. If you have any questions or if you have, a que if you have anything you want me to bring up on a blog, please don't hesitate to email me, john at johnconley.com. Thank you.